One of the struggles we have sometimes is it's not easy to always account for all the unspoken things. And that's one of the things I'm trying to solve with Chiller Academy is take as many of those unspokens that are just kind of things we know that we've learned and picked up along the way or somebody has passingly shared and then put all that unspoken information somewhere where it's accessible. You'll see that option presented and then it's very easy for for us to sometimes forget but i'm only going to do this in this particular scenario because of this right and i'm not going to do this in that scenario because the conditions changed and there is fluctuations and variability and i don't want to create a problem but we don't always take the time to explain that so that's one of the things we have to also be mindful of is sometimes these are things that we'll do because we feel that they're shortcuts we're comfortable taking but that doesn't make them the right thing to do and there's not as doesn't make them the buy the book thing to do, which means that there is more risk in following that path. You the the chances of something going wrong are far higher if you don't do it correctly versus the buy the book will probably keep you the safest with least amount of of risk. I'll say it that way. It's also going to keep you out of legal trouble, right? So that's the other thing of this. We have the liability aspect to the whole thing of when we, what procedures we choose to follow. You choose the wrong path, something happens, you are liable or your company is liable either way, depending on your circumstances. A lot of the little things that we think about and we do or don't do and all those, there's a lot of little decisions we make, especially once we get experienced that younger guys that are trying to learn just they haven't had to make those decisions those little improv improvisions just don't connect the same because they haven't had to live through that and I, I really think it's been one of my things that i wasn't conscious of it for a really long time like a really long time and i, I don't think the majority majority of people as we gain experience i don't think it's not an intentional thing but we're just not conscious of how much of those little imp improvisions, if that's a word, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go with it. Is there's a lot of those that we we just don't even realize are there. Things we had we just figured out on on our own. Being conscious of that and being able to communicate that to somebody who's trying to grasp it, I see how important that is and how much of a struggle that creates and why there's sometimes so much frustration between apprentice and senior. Uh, this this being able to translate all of those little unspokens is, is not easy. I like guess it's really difficult to process through, a, well, why do I feel that way? Why do I choose that path? Why go on X instead of Y? And it's all of those little things that you've had to deal with a thousand freaking times that just drive you nuts that, that makes you know better and why you choose to take that path. If you're not already in Chiller Academy, I'd really encourage you to go check it out. Just think about it, right? Uh, this is what I do full time. I, I've, I've committed, I've stepped out of the field, committed my career to this going forward. This is what I've always wanted to do and to be able to educate, help others and grow and help this industry take step, steps forward. Um, so chilleracademy.com, like I'd, I'd love to be able to work with you over there. We've got a community page. Uh, every, all the lessons have a comment section. That's what I spend a lot of my day doing. If I'm not working on the lesson material itself, then I am in the comments and I'm trying to respond to those as fast as I can, uh, in addition to helping you through email and otherwise. So love to be able to work with you. For all of those that are in the academy, y'all are doing some great work out there. Keep it up. I really appreciate the support and the feedback that you've given.